In these problems, we're looking at what's called draws with replacement. And that's the kind of situation where, let's say, you have a bag of marbles, and some of them are red and some of them are green, and you're asked to, to uh, pull three of them out. But you pull one out, you check its color, then you throw it back in again and mix them all up, and each pull is from the full number of marbles. That's a draw with replacement. Uh, rolling dice is really the same kind of thing because that probability of getting a certain number on the die is the same no matter how many times you roll the die. Let's look at this first one. It says a fair die is rolled five times. What is the probability that a three is obtained on at least one of the rolls? And round your answer to three decimal places. At first glance, this looks pretty tricky. You could have a three on one of the rolls, two of the rolls, four, three, four, five of the rolls. Um, so how do we actually approach this? One thing that can come in handy in a situation like this is what's called the complement rule. And, you know, if you can divide the probability of a situation into either one thing or another, then you can use the, the complement rule, which basically says that if it's not the one thing, then it's the other, which means that the probability of one of the things is one minus the probability of the other. So one minus the probability of whatever, I'm going to call it x, is the probability of the other half of this, I'm going to call it y. We can use that here because it's easier to think about the probability of not rolling any threes. And in this situation, you either roll at least one three or you roll no threes at all. Well, what's the probability of rolling no threes at all? The probability of rolling not a three on the first roll is five out of six because there are six spots, six sides on the die and only one of them is three. So that's the probability of not rolling a three one time. If we want the probability of not rolling a three five times, we're going to multiply this five times or just raise it to the fifth power. So this is the probability of not rolling any threes at all in five rolls. We're going to use the complement rule now to go after the other part of this, which is rolling at least one three. And so this answer is just going to be one minus five over six to the fifth power. So let's go ahead and calculate that. I'll grab my calculator here. And what I get is about 0.598. All right, let's try another one. And this one is actually a little bit easier. It says a fair die is rolled five times. What is the probability of having no three and no five among the rolls? And again, three decimal places we're going to round to. So the probability of having no three or no five on one roll is four out of six because the three and the five are two sides of the die, there are four other sides. So not rolling a three or five is a four out of six on one roll. We want to do this five times in a row. That's just going to be four sixths to the fifth. So we'll do that math. So there's two thirds, uh, y to the x, five. And that comes out to be about 0.132. All right, let's try one more. All right, and this is a problem where we actually are pulling uh, marbles or balls out of um, an urn in this case. So it says an urn contains nine white and five green balls. Uh, six balls are randomly drawn from the urn in succession with replacement. That is, after each draw, the selected ball is returned to the urn. What is the probability that all six balls drawn from the urn are white? So the way we want to think about this is, what's the probability that one ball drawn out is white. Well, you have nine white and five green. That's a total of 14. And there are nine out of those 14 chances to get a white ball. So that would be nine over 14. And then since we're throwing that ball back in every time, we can just take this to the sixth power. So this should just be nine fourteenths to the sixth power. And I'm getting about 0.071. So that's a little bit of work with the probability of draws with replacement.